Conagra Foods, one of the world's largest food conglomerates, appears ripe for a split up. The $15 billion market cap food company lowered its 2015 guidance in February, primarily due to reduced operating profit in its private label business, Rawcorp. Former CEO Gary Rodkin had engineered the 2012 acquisition of Rawcorp for close to $5 billion. But he wasn't the only CEO to take a company in this direction. Unilever acquired Best Foods for more than $20 billion in 2007, and Kraft picked up Cadbury in 2010 for about $19 billion. Both of these deals ultimately had to be unwound after they failed to produce the kind of growth the buyers had sought. Most important to the split-up scenario is that Conagra has missed the boat on the natural and organic trend and has a host of brands consumers have simply fallen out of love with, like Peter Pan peanut butter and Pam cooking sprays. What could ultimately spur a deal, however, is that the company's new CEO, Sean Connolly, is not a newcomer to M&A. Connolly held the top job at Hillshire's Brands when the sausage maker was acquired by Tyson Foods last year in an $8.6 billion deal. The deal's Richard Collings will be watching this situation closely, so stay tuned for more. I'm Amanda Levin, and that's The Deal.